Hello everybody, it's your boy Brunel Jones II and I'm back with another episode of what it's like to be a musician in New York City. So this episode is a little different as they all are because I guess, you know, I'm documenting different gigs each episode. I will be traveling to New Hampshire to perform at a wedding. Right after that, I got to drive straight to downtown New York to play at the Red Line once again, as you've seen on a previous episode. But this time I'm playing at Red Line at St. Patrick's Day. So it's a St. Patrick's Day celebration party. It's probably gonna be super, super packed. I've already packed my fit because one thing I've learned playing at that bar all winter, it's pretty hot in that bar because it's packed tight a lot of people. So even though it's winter, I'm wearing a green tank top. St. Patrick's Day, you dig? A new announcement to make, I once again joined a new gym. Let me explain myself. So the last video, I made an announcement that I joined a new gym. That video, even though it was uploaded last week, the footage was actually filmed weeks ago. And that's just because, you know, life gets in the way. I've been having a lot of work, which is fortunate. And also I got to travel with family, which is why I have allergies, because when I travel, I get allergies in the different environments and whatnot. But basically the reason why I joined a new gym again is because, you know, I've, I've been lately obsessed with, you know, working on my big lifts like the squat bitch deadlift and I can't deadlift at that gym anymore because the gym is fairly new and their floors aren't reinforced and something happened, you know, long story short. So I don't want to compromise any of my workouts. And so I started, you know, I joined a new gym. <laughs> For those of you who are new to the channel, a long time ago, many episodes ago, I asked the viewers if they wanted to see gym footage because I am a gym rat. And I would put footage in there all the time. And I wanted to make sure that people actually enjoyed seeing it because I know it doesn't have anything to do with music. And pretty much most people, I'd say like nine out of 10 people said that they wanted to. So we're gonna continue that. I also hit a new PR a few weeks ago. I never showed you all that. A squat PR, 365. <laughs> I unfortunately won't be getting any gym footage today because I just don't have time. I gotta drive to New Hampshire, then I gotta drive back to downtown New York City. Anyways, let's get to it. I gotta take a shower and get ready, and then I gotta go. Yeah, dig? All right, I just showered, got the fit for today. You dig? Boom. It's gonna be a good day, and it's cold. So, you know, I gotta wear a turtleneck with the suit instead of just a regular button down shirt all right so if you made it this far in the video i want to let you know that i'm trying something new a lot of people have been asking me a lot of questions whether it's my email my dm or the youtube comments and i haven't been able to answer all of them so i'm gonna do something new in the next video and i'm gonna do a q a at the end of the video the next video will be a regular what it's like to be in new york city vlog where i take you along my day and show you how the gig goes but at the end of the video, I'll be answering your questions. So if you want me to answer your questions, send me a DM and start the DM off with Q and A and then ask me a question so I'll know it's specifically for the video. So for example, Q and A, what do you like to eat at breakfast? Ask me anything music related or just my day related and I will try my best to answer as many as I can at the end of the next video. Gotta get those gains. All right, let's go. All right, fast forward, I just got here. That was a long drive, but, oh, I dropped my stand. We're in New Hampshire. This is my second time playing out here. It's just so empty. Yeah, this is the room that we're set up in. I'm getting my saxophone set up. That's the pianist. Say what's up to the people. What's good, how's it going? All right, all right. <laughs> it's a cool little telephone booth. I don't know why it's here, but I mean, this is an old building. This is an interesting building to have a wedding in. I gotta be quiet, but apparently we're doing 
just gas for this, which is not normal. Uh, normally I play pop and stuff at weddings, but it's cool, just me. Oh, that's beautiful. That was fun and easy. I'm heading back to the city now to go play at the Red Lion for this, um, what is it, Lucky Charm Day? <laughs> this St. Patrick's Day celebration. And um, gotta get some espresso. It is almost midnight in Connecticut. Why is there a traffic jam this heavy? It's just Connecticut, chill. I'm so sleepy, I changed. Just pulled up to Red Lion. Excuse me. I'm about to get me an espresso and then I'm gonna walk into Red Lion. All right, so I just got my espresso. Apparently, so I just ran into the guitarist. Apparently, it's dead tonight. You know, I mean, it is a Sunday, but it's always packed in there. And I expected it to be packed just because it's St. Patrick's Day, but I guess everybody celebrated yesterday, so. Yeah, it's dead here. Yeah, it's four in the morning. I just got home. I'm gonna sleep in, but I still need to go to the gym tomorrow. So hold me accountable. 
I'll see y'all. Signing out. Camera on. Is it working? All right, everybody. That concludes the gig footage. Just two announcements that I have to make. The first announcement, in New York City, my band that I lead is playing at Small's Jazz Club. We're playing my original music. <music> On April 10th. There's more details in the description. Also, for my Bostoners or Bostonites, whatever they call them, you know, people in Boston have been hitting me up, musicians and non-musicians. They want to know when I'm coming to Boston. Well, now I'm coming to Boston with the pianist Anthony Wanzi on April 19th. You can reserve seats and tables. We're playing at Scholars Jazz Club. The ticket link will also be in the description. For my long-term fans, I know that you've probably noticed that the videos have been coming in large intervals of time. I've gone over a month between uploads. I'm committing to not doing that anymore. I'm trying to upload every week, and if not every week, definitely every other week. And I've been good about it so far. So watch the previous videos. You can binge watch the whole series. I made a playlist of the whole What It's Like Being a Musician in New York City series. You can watch all of those just to get caught up to where we are right now. And each week you can continue to watch the new episodes. I hope you all enjoyed. Make sure you follow me on social medias. Make sure you buy my music. In the description, I do have a link to my band camp, which has all my previous EPs and small albums. And also make sure you subscribe, you dig? Sin, Sin City was made for you.